Are you just all business all the time, are you, Charlie? <laughs> I told you there's nothing to worry about. Thanks. What I still feel when I'm around you, it's intense. Okay, and there's no point pretending that I wasn't tempted to go home with you yesterday. There's no point pretending I wasn't trying to tempt you. That's why I'm here. To tell you that I was wrong about us being able to be friends. I can't do it. I want more than that. Well, I can't do it either. And I want more too. The feelings that I have for you... Okay, I don't trust them. Don't let this ruin things for us. us what, are you serious? Us doesn't even exist. We should have been kissing in the first place. But we did. Didn't we? And now that we've come that close, I couldn't deal with it if you backed off again. Oh, Brax, you're going to have to deal with it. Okay, so am I. All right. We should. We should get back to the restaurant. <laughs> what is it? Nothing. Are oh, you not still worried about Heath, are you? Yeah, I, I told you I'd take care of it. And Charlie, what we have is pretty special. There's no way I'll let him mess it up. Max, it's already messed up. Doesn't matter if he says something or not. Sooner or later, my bosses are going to find out. No, they won't. Not if we're very careful. come up and I have to go. I'm sorry. Yeah, you can't keep going after him without it affecting us. It just, it doesn't work that way. Not in your world and definitely not in mine. Look, I had no idea Tegan was going to show up last night, eh? I had no idea Tegan existed. Hey, you sound almost a little bit jealous. Curious. About why you've never mentioned her before and why she's turned up here demanding to know who you're seeing. Well, I never mentioned it because she's ancient history. The only reason she's showing up in town is because my mother's trying to cause trouble. Seriously, Charlie, you got nothing to worry about. So, this case here? Right? Yeah, it's not about him. I ran into Tegan. Ah, oh, is that all? She knows about us. How's that? I don't know. Well, she's, she's probably just fishing. Yeah, you didn't tell her anything. Oh, yeah, I confessed the whole thing. What do you think? And she wasn't just fishing. I hope she'd put the whole thing together. I'm going to kill my mother for involving her in this. Yeah, well, what's Tegan going to do with this information? <sighs> Nothing. Max, if she tells your mum or Heath, then you're in real danger. She won't tell. Well, I wish I could believe that, but her words herself were, the secret's not safe with me. She'll keep her mouth shut. Yeah, and how exactly are you going to make that happen? I just will. Don't worry about it. So. 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 Um, maybe take this conversation hey. Hey, back to my place. Oh. What are you going to do? Uh, thanks. But, you know, this, this is my responsibility and I've got to deal with it. What? You are a surprising man. That's a nice thing to hear. I know I've said it before, but Casey's very lucky to have you. 